2022 has been a pretty good year in terms of art. So what I'm going to be doing is making a tier list of all of my art from this year. There's a lot of it. So we're only going to be ranking the pieces that took over an hour. And the first drawing I did this year was of my guinea pig. I think it's pretty good. It's not bad. I'll do B tier for this one because there's some shading in it that I think I kind of messed up on. Then we have Red from Animal Crossing. I think I'm also going B tier for him because that was that was kind of a quick one. Green Goblin. Now this, this one has to go S tier. I spent like eight hours on this one. I still love this one. This is the one like if people ask me to show them a drawing, I show them this one. I love this one. This might be my favorite drawing of the entire year. Then we have Bruno. Um, I mean, it's a good drawing, but like, I hate we don't talk about Bruno. That song's so annoying, so it's going C tier. This cat, same thing, C tier. Because the cat looks okay, but I don't know. The eyes, I don't know. They, I have a problem with the eyes. I don't like them. Owl watercolor here. I think another C tier. Because, I don't know, I'm not great at watercolor. That was like my first ever watercolor piece in years. Same thing with the toucan. It was made the day after another watercolor piece. And it's okay. But not great. Now this one, I don't know if it's my best, really. But I think it has to, it just has to go in S tier. Because this t thing took me so long. And it's the biggest uh, piece of art I have ever made. So it's, that's just an automatic S tier. This one, it looks okay. I'll go A tier for this one because it's like a remake of an old one. I don't like the hair on it though. For Toad, we'll go B tier since he's just like really simple to draw, but the shading on it's cool. Spider-Man, that's D tier. I made this one like an hour before a tennis practice or something when I was bored and it's just with like Posca pens and I mean, it, it's okay, but it's very flat and cartoony, obviously, because that's kind of the point of Posca pens. I just don't like it that much. Now this one, this might be the worst drawing of the entire year. It's a gouache painting. It's my first ever gouache painting, and it just looks so awful. So this one's F tier. Then this is my second ever gouache painting, and this one's definitely a lot better. This one will go C tier. It's still not great. I kind of messed up on the proportions on that one. Like that one, the proportions are really messed up on. But that one, it's a little better. Joker, he's B, B tier. The next painting we have is of this baby. This is when I was really trying to get good at gouache. Kind of failed. It made the baby's eyes too small. So uh, D tier. Now we have this pug and this pug just ended up looking very ugly. Pugly. That was so bad, why did I say that? Uh, C tier though, cause, no, 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 he's going D tier too, cause there's just something really off about his face. This next one was just a pencil drawing of Mr. Beast, cause everyone kept claiming I was drawing him over and over again, cause I draw a lot of guys with beards, and yeah, they do kind of look like Mr. Beast. But I got his proportions um, down really quickly, and it looks exactly like him, so we're gonna go A tier, cause I didn't mess up on that one. Next, we have my sad attempt at the 100 heads challenge. I got 39 faces in and then, then, then I gave up. So that's why this is going in E tier, not F tier because um, I still spent a very long time on those faces. It just, I never finished it, so. Next might be one of my best gouache paintings. I, it, it was Eleven from Stranger Things. She kind of looks like a baby. So we'll go A tier for this one just cause why not. I like the shading of it all, but the proportions are bad. I don't care though. I, it's kind of stylized. I like it. Now this was my first time using charcoal and I tried to draw a coca-cola bottle. I don't usually draw objects. As you can see, I draw portraits and animals, stuff like that. So this was out of my comfort zone and it looks okay. Not the best. We'll go E tier cause it's really not that good though. And same thing with this gouache painting. I hate this painting so much. It looks like Twilight Sparkle. Now for this frog. This was a remake of a drawing I did in 2017. You know, it was just like a quick thing I did on an afternoon. So we'll go C tier. Doesn't look bad. Doesn't look great either. <laughs> now we have this one. This is from my video where I drew things that I hated. And I ended up really liking this piece. We'll go B tier. 
Now we have this one. This is probably my best quad painting. Uh, so that will go A tier. Now this one, this is S tier. This is my drawing of one from Stranger Things 4. I love this one. <laughs> this, this one. I have to stop doing that. It took me like five hours. I just sat around and watched Gilmore Girls and uh, drew this one. So that's, I like that one. And that's my first polychromos portrait, I think, is it? It might be my fir first portrait with polychromos pencils. Next we have this ugly thing. It's going F tier. I was trying a new blending technique to blend my pencils. Didn't really work well. For this one, this one will go D tier. It's just like a simple thing. I was trying the combination of ink and colored pencils. This will go A tier. It's just a simple portrait with polychromos, but I really like it. This one looks way too much like Harry Styles and I wasn't trying to draw Harry Styles. I was experimenting with a uh, really strict color palette, so I was only using purples and yellows. Next we have my first ever charcoal portrait. This one is pretty good, uh, but kind of average, so C tier for this. Now we have this realistic Pikachu. This one is so creepy. It's so creepy for no reason too. Like it looks like it should be cute. It's not cute at all. So uh, we'll go E tier. Now this koala one, this was with my uh, drawing process video. B tier, not my favorite. This one, this is a painting I did in like an hour before I went to bed one day. I couldn't get the eyes right, so he has no eyes. We'll call it an artistic choice though. Now another very ugly gouache painting, F tier, because it's ugly and, and bad. I also use black to shade it and I, I make the mistake so many times, even though I know not to do it. I know not to shade with black because then it just like turns out looking weird. You could, I tend to reserve black for just the eyes and then uh, st still sometimes I do it and uh, yeah. This next one, uh, I made late August when I was live streaming a lot. I made this throughout like probably three live streams, except I never got to finish it because then I had to go to school. Uh, we'll go uh, D tier because it's not finished. This next one looks pretty cool. It's different from a lot of my other art pieces. So B tier. Some of the proportions are weird though. This next one I think is also no, this one's a C tier, pretty average. I used a watercolor base before I put on the pencils, which, you know, made a whole video about that. This Chance Picks My Art. I hate this one for no reason. S tier. It's Corgi with a Santa hat. So cute. Probably the cutest thing I've ever drawn. So uh, he deserves a spot up there. But this next one was a cat with a scarf on. I, was, I have a theme here, if you can't see. Uh, F tier, because I'm bad at drawing cats. Next one, I did a French bulldog wearing a bow tie. <laughs> and uh, that one's cute, not as cute as the other one though, so B tier. Then uh, this one I made with just a pen. I'd say B tier, because it was really fun to make and didn't take that long. Next one is a painting. I'll go C tier. Now we have the German Shepherd with glasses. This one's D tier, because I uh, the glasses just don't work on dogs, I'm sorry. It just doesn't work. I think I'll go E tier. It's a watercolor painting, but while I was painting it, my chair snapped in half. And uh, I still haven't got a new chair. My, I'm still sitting on half a chair right now. This next one's a gouache painting. It just kind of looks different from all my gouache paintings and you're making such a weird expression that it has to go A tier. My first ever time using oil pastels. It was the day after Christmas, so like, you know, a couple days ago. Oh, I made the eyes too far up and some of the proportions are off. But I like oil pastels now. It will go D tier, just cause it's not a great piece of art, but oh, this one's S tier. I love this one so much. Uh, I'm, I have like a charcoal drawing obsession now. And uh, then this one, this one I made last night, just in like an hour. It was a charcoal portrait. Yeah, and it's, it's pretty good. I like it. So B tier. So this is all the art I made this year. Well, not all the art, we have the countless sketchbooks and doodles and everything. And Inktober. Oh yeah, I forgot about Inktober. Tell me what your favorite one is and what your least favorite one is in the comments. Thanks for watching and have a great rest of your year, even though it's only a couple hours.